To create a drawing, go to File, New Drawing. If you want to create an exploded view of an assembly, select From Animation. In our case, we are just creating a simple drawing of a part, so we will be selecting From Design. The Full Assembly option is checked by default. If you want to create a drawing of a particular body, uncheck this option and pick the appropriate body from the model. Under Standards, there is the ASME standard and the ISO standard. The important thing to take note here is that the ASME standard uses third angle projection, while the ISO standard uses first. I will leave it to you to explore the other options. Once you hit OK, you will be brought into the first sheet with the front view ready to be placed. At this point, you can change the orientation, style, scale, and edge visibility before placing the view. Once the view has been placed, you can double click on the drawing view to bring up the drawing view options to make changes. To insert a projected view, you can press P or go to Drawing Views, Projected View. At this point, you will be asked to select the parent view. By moving to the various sides of the parent view, you can place multiple projected views. Hit Enter to exit from the Projecting Views tool. You can add in dimensions by pressing D or going to Dimensions, Dimension. Hover over an H to get a preview and click to place a dimension down. Select points or edges to get the appropriate dimension. Go to Text, Text to create a standalone text box. You can also create a text box with a leader that points to a certain feature in a drawing view.